Okay, so with this 99 Lexus ES300, uh, you know, I've done a lot of work on it. I've basically replaced the entire suspension, meaning the uh, I've replaced all four bearings. Uh, I replaced all of the uh, sway bar links, made sure that they were all properly lubricated, uh, you know, the new ones that I got in. I've replaced the upper, or I'm sorry, the lower control arm on the front, new shocks and struts. Uh, so, you know, basically what we're looking at is a new suspension. One of the reasons that I did all this work was, you know, I noticed a, you know, kind of a rattling sound when I drove the vehicle. So, I started looking at things like, well, it sounded like it was coming from the engine compartment. So I started looking at, well, maybe the engine's rattling. So I, uh, I took the dog bone off, got a new dog bone, replaced that. Uh, there is a, another engine, another motor mount uh, on this car up under this tire. Uh, back behind there, there's a little panel. There's another motor mount under there. I've replaced that. There are three more motor mounts on this 99 Lexus CS300. One of them is this thing right here. The big canister looking thing with the screw with the bolts on top uh, I don't know what the technical name is for it but it's a motor mount of some sort and I just so happen to have a replacement part for that there was also one right here it looked more like a piston that's this guy I just pulled it out it was four 14 millimeter bolts wasn't that hard to pull out as long as you have uh, I used a, I used this air tool right here this angular air tool uh, it helped a lot and then I used a really long extension on a uh, and I used this two foot pry bar that's more than two feet that might, that might be two and a half anyway point is at this point I've got that one taken off but as I was working on this one thing I noticed was that the that the radiator was moving about and I was able to move it with my hand and then I noticed that these guys it's moving here and here so I put a lot of thought into this and I came up with this very technical solution I took paper towels and folded them up so they're very dense and I put one here and I put one here and guess what no more radiator rattle so you know you can spend all the money in the world sometimes it's just the cheap simple things that you notice working on a vehicle that that make all the difference I have a feeling that that was what was causing all of the ruckus when I was driving uh, but I'm gonna go ahead and finish out these motor mounts now that I've got one of them taken out may as well put the other ones in as well anyway I'm gonna put this together and I'll give you a video update to see how it went